I'm Laylee Ipsa. I'm Robert Tuke. Reporting for Cal TV News outside of Poly Ballroom. On Friday evening around 6.45 p.m., the ASUC released results for student candidates and the executive slate. Here's our exclusive interview with President Alexander and Academic Affairs Vice President Melanie. Why is this victory important to you? We came out of this really just focusing on sending a message, um, getting to know students, talking to students, um, really being there on the ground and just having conversations because I think that's what elections are about. And um, you know, it, it resonated and that's what really means something to me is that we, we have uh, 11 senators and three executives in all the positions that we contested and people cared about um, student action and, and, and the message that we sent. I personally decided to run for AVP in February. I'm very unsure of like how this election would turn out, but I was very passionate about the platforms that I was running on and I thought that I could be the best AVP for this campus and we were like, how can we be better? How can we outreach to every single community and make sure that we're representing every single campus, on, like every single student on this campus? and I think that really resonated with people and that they saw that we were trying to represent their best interests. Have you thought about your first order of business? Yeah. <laughs> like being AVP Chief of Staff this past semester, I've already met with all of the relevant stakeholders that I want to like get my platforms done and so immediately getting started on like things on like reforming grants and scholarships and working with the Career Center and like the library. So yeah, I've kind of already been working on it but like continuing yeah. the work is now exactly. going to go on. You know, this is this is about um, students who want to take initiative on this campus, and um, it's not about me. It's about our office and what we're going to do.